one of the officers in my office is the person the whole in the office of the policy analyst. Honorable Speaker, the policy analyst in the office of the leader of minority party plays a very, very crucial role in enabling the holder of that office to perform his work. Honorable Speaker, on the eve of today's sitting, specifically this morning, Honorable Speaker, at 2.20 a.m. this morning, I was called by the policy analyst in the office of the minority leader, one Gabriel Owiti Oguda. Gabriel Owiti Oguda, that is the policy analyst in the office of the leader of minority. He called me this morning under distress that there are there were people, in fact, he called them cops. I think cops means policemen. At his gate, breaking into his compound. The issues I'm raising are so serious that I would I want to request my brother Pukose to uh, be patient. Honorable Speaker, Mr. Gabriel Oguda called me at 2.20 a.m. this morning, informing me that there are people at his gate who were breaking into his compound. No sooner had he called me, Honorable Speaker, I mobilized lawyers, lawyers to try and attend to his situation. But within no minute, Honorable Speaker, <coughs> for members' order, I need to hear Honorable Speaker, 10 minutes after Mr. Oguda called me, my phone calls were jammed. I was unable to call nor to receive calls until about 6.30 this morning. Honorable Speaker, in the ensuing period, these persons actually broke the gate of Honorable Oguda's compound, went further to break his door, and abducted him. Up to this moment, I'm speaking here, we do not know the whereabouts of Mr. Oguda, who is an officer in the office of the leader of the minority party, an officer who is supposed to make our work possible. Happening on the eve of this very special day, Honorable Speaker, we don't take it lightly. And I want to explain further, Honorable Speaker. The persons who abducted Mr. Oguda are not known even though in his phone call to me at 2.20 a.m., he, he indicated they were policemen. We have looked in all police stations in Nairobi and environs. He is nowhere to be seen. We don't know whether they kill him or they are holding him in communicado somewhere. Honorable Speaker, we do not know. 